Guys, I gotta tell you, this video right here is it the epitome of exactly where a lot of the far leftists want to see our society go, right? Where you are rewarded just because of your gender, because of your color, because of your background, because of everything that has nothing to do with the work that you put in, okay? Life is about hard work. You put in the work, and you reap the benefits, okay? That's why, you know, generally speaking, for the most part, you know, I'm not so uh, big on, you know, taxing people that's in the middle class and the upper middle class because particularly those people work pretty hard, right? The average everyday American that goes to work, you know, puts in the work, does they got to do, they work very hard, okay? Now, Vanderbilt, I'm pretty sure you guys remember, uh, <laughs> was losing. They were losing. They sucked. Terrible team. OK, and, 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 and for whatever reason, uh, it was so bad that, you know, at some point they didn't even have a kicker. So for whatever reason, uh, somebody thought that it was a good idea, maybe the coaching staff to <laughs> try to make some history here outside of their pathetic record and have a woman from the soccer team come and be a kicker on the football team. Now, everybody was given. Uh, Sarah Fuller, her props, and, and really congratulate her about making history, right? She goes out there, kicks a little squib, you know, runs to the sideline, doesn't really put herself in any danger. Everybody's celebrating, okay? And, you know, she's getting nominated for awards, and they're saying that she's courageous and all this and that, right? It's really the antithesis of what sports is supposed to be. Sports is supposed to be a meritocracy, okay? Where, again, you put in the work, you know, and... If you win, great, right? You get all the rewards for winning. But if you lose, nobody's patting you on the back for being a loser, okay? Now, unfortunately, that's not the direction that a lot of people want our society to go. And it's funny because this video uh, came out that basically displayed just how bad Sarah Fuller actually were, was and how much of a joke her being on the football team actually was. And really, it was just a pr scam so take a look at this video of her practicing uh kicking field goals here <laughs> terrible terrible absolutely terrible that don't look like anybody that should be kicking on a college football team Again, I was surprised when this thing came out. I was like, they couldn't find somebody, somebody that's on the football team that can kick, right? As athletic as these guys are, somebody can kick better than she can, right? Nope, they were acting like she was fully qualified to be on the team, okay? So as you can see here, when the actual video comes out of her actually attempting to kick a real field goal, she blundered it, which explains why she never actually really did a real kick in the game right because she's not that good and again this is the type of stuff that you know is is not good for us culturally because it sets an example where you can get rewarded for something that you didn't necessarily earn sports is supposed to be a meritocracy now what i do like in a meritocracy that i do celebrate is sarah thomas who is a woman that is going to be officiating in the nfl now i 100 percent support this okay because sarah thomas if you read her story she started doing this way back in uh, i think the 90s right she had been refereeing for a long 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 time okay working high school games working her way up and then getting into uh, uh, fo uh college football and then in, in 2015 finally getting uh, a full-time position in the NFL. And then six years later, you know, she's the first female ref in the Super Bowl. That's the American dream. These are the type of stories when we talk about celebrating women and celebrating accomplishments from women, like breaking the barrier, right? This is what we should be celebrating. Sarah Fuller is not what we should be celebrating. We need more Sarah Thomases, those who actually put in the work, who earned it, who showed that, you know what? I can compete at the same level as a man uh, in a, a job that...
that performance isn't necessarily tied to your genitalia, right? I'm all for that. I'm 100% for that. So, you know, the media, I have seen this story a lot, but, you know, I think the media, if they're going to hype a story, this would be it. And I have seen them hype this, so I'm not going to say they haven't. But, yeah, guys, I think it's just funny seeing uh, <laughs> kind of two sides, right, of, you know, how... Um, you know, left wants us to go in society and then, you know, another side of how things are supposed to be. I just think it's really funny. I think it also just shows how uh, ridiculous some of the stuff is with the left when you have people like Sarah Thomas who prove that, you know, if women put in the work and they can, they compete, you know, they get rewarded just like everybody else. And there's no need for, you know, the hand-me-downs. So let me know what you guys think. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Most importantly, share a black conservative perspective. Peace.